Hey guys, Josh here with Looting the Queen episode 5, which is actually the last episode. So it's been like a good two months, I think, since episode 4, and I apologise for the long wait, but I have now finally finished the series, actually. It's only been five episodes, but I have done, I mean, not even that many kills, uh, to be quite honest. I think it's about like roughly 50 kills per episode. This episode I managed to do 79, so I upped it a bit, but I managed to get all the remaining drops and a load of duplicates in this episode. Um, but that is like, it's only around like 300 kills I must have done um, in these five videos to get all the drops, so I did really quite well I guess. Um, well kind of, because I think the drop rate of the kite shield is about 1 in 200, and so um, in 300 kills, like, I'm a bit off for that, I guess, but Visage is, like, 1 in 100, same with Dragon Bone Upgrade Kit, and I got quite a few of those. I'm not sure about the Royal Pieces, uh, they are fairly common, but I'm just looking at the tab now, uh, which I'll show you all later, and it's got a lot of nice stuff in there, uh, loads of items, so that's always nice to see, and the mini loot, that is the main, like, part of QBD, really, they really do add up, and I think I'll do an official price check at the end of the video but it's looking at around like 60 mil plus I reckon so like it's really pretty good it's a lot of money there also I've just been doing a lot better at QBD recently uh, using full, uh, full Cyrenic of Ascensions has actually been working really well like the majority of the kills I can get in about four and a half minutes or not kills um, like per overload dose so two kills I can get in a like within the overload dose so about four and a half minutes which is really quite good a bad kill is like five minutes at max so like I'm getting a lot better at it I'm using a uni now because really like you use very little food so a uni is the best option um, I could have yacked it and then gone for like an hour trips or so but it doesn't even matter that much really um, the unis worked perfectly fine so um, yeah that's my setup really uh, I guess that's probably changed since the beginning of the series but this is like I think dry are the best but this range is actually working out pretty nicely now especially with cruelty that they buff that um, but yeah so I will now show you all the loot I got uh, from this episode Hey, 
So, in terms of the loot, the main drops, which was what the series was about, obviously I've now got them all, but um, in terms of how many, so at the moment I am on four torsion springs up from two last episode, three royal sites, that didn't actually change, um, I had three in episode four as well, and now three royal frames up from one, and five bolt stabilizers from four, so I got more of all of them apart from the royal site. Um, quite a few more, so that's definitely going to add up. And then I got, I now have three Dragon Bone upgrade kits, um, up from two, and I managed to get two Visages, uh, which really wasn't expected. Like, I thought getting one would be hard enough, and then I managed to get a second one as well, so that was really cool. And that's like, that's the most expensive drop, so I'm kind of glad that I got like two Visages rather than like two Dragon Kite Shields, because Visage is about 1.1 mil, so that's actually pretty decent. So I got two of those, and on the last kill I got a Dragon Kite Shield to complete the series so that is all looking really cool so now it's time to sell the tab okay so this is it the looting the queen tab at the end you can see all the lovely uh, QBD items at the bottom there and this is the whole thing so I'll quickly do a price check we can just take everything out um, if I note it that is and take everything out and see how much it's worth uh, 6.3 mil we take that out from here 6.3 mil there we go I think I'll probably need to do two invents is looking like uh, there's quite a lot of stuff in here actually we'll just we'll do the mini loots at first and then we can just add in the um, the main loot because obviously like the main loot isn't even worth that much but it's just nice to see how much that's all worth so just a few more, got a few like troll drops here, uh, loop halves, rune spear, rune square shield, okay, so price check this, that's 55 mil, so just the mini loots, 55 mil, really nice that, and now for the main stuff, so, uh, wow, this all deposits, there we go, take out these, and there we go. How much is this worth? 55 plus 9.3, so we're looking at like 64 mil, um, maybe 65 mil, so it's a lot of money there. Uh, but I'm now going to go sell it all and see the final price drop. Okay, so all sold and I went for a bit under G, so 62.9 mil, almost 63 mil. It's a bit worrying when none of that Royal was selling there, but all done. The tab is now gone, so I hope you guys enjoyed this series and I'll see you later.